to food by background checking my girlfriend. We've been together a year and some change. Live together. She uses a flip phone for reasons that are too long to get into, so she will occasionally use my phone when she needs to check her email or download music. Back to my dumbass. I'm not going to lie you all, I trashed my brain as a teenager. I have issues with memory, short and long. But today I woke up and was chilling for a bit while my girl was at work. Suddenly I thought oh shit what's my GF's birthday. I knew what month it was in, but I couldn't remember if it was the 8th or 9th. That's okay, I thought, I'll go dig around a bit. Surely Terry's some paperwork around the house that has her birthday on it. Spoiler, there wasn't. I'm definitely not asking her friends or family as they'll surely tell her I forgot. So I do what any reasonable guy does, and I google background check services. Enter her name and city, and for $7.99 I receive an email with every traffic ticket, address, and phone number she's ever had. Most importantly though, her birthday. I write her birthday down in a safe spot and then go back to chilling. All is well. I'm not a piece of shit boyfriend, what a relief. She gets home, our day is going well, when she asks to use my phone to read her email. I completely obliviously give it to her. She opens it, and immediately she sees a full background check on herself. I knew exactly what happened once her face changed. She immediately asked why I was background checking her, a year into our relationship, and then started getting emotional, asking if I didn't trust her etc. This is the first relationship I've ever not had trust issues in, so I immediately confess that I am a dumbass, I forgot her birthday, and I paid $7.99 to get it, because her sister and friends would snitch on me. LOL. Luckily this isn't the first time I've came off as a total moron to her, so she believed me, but she is indeed also a bit upset I forgot her birthday. Next time something like this happens I'm just admitting guilt I think. I'm also sitting here and just realized I could have waited till she was asleep and checked her license. TL, D or I forgot my GF speed A, background checked her to find it out, then accidentally showed it to her on my phone, causing her to think I don't trust her. Lol I thought she was going to end up having a lengthy track record and you'd discover she's a leader of a prominent gang or something. Why didn't you just say that you couldn't remember if it was on the 8th or 9th? It's really not that bad, you 99% remembered it anyways. How tf do you run these background checks? That's insane. My now wife's mom background checked me after my wife and I moved in together. She found out that I was still married to my ex-wife. She came over with a dossier on me and slapped it on the table for my wife to see. My wife looked at it and started laughing. You see, my wife was at the time a notary. She was the one who notarized my divorce papers. So she definitely already knew. So I do what any reasonable guy does, and I google background check services. Enter her name and city, and for $7.99 I receive an email with every traffic ticket, address, and phone number she's ever had. Most importantly though, her birthday. This exists. Mark her birthday down in your phone's calendar right now and set it to repeat every year. Do this now. So, anything good on her background check? I really don't believe this. Nobody pays for a background check because they forgot a birthday. Literally nobody. I think it's more likely that he did a background check for some other reason and then made up this. Terrible story when he got caught. I expected to see no history and that she is some spy. Also, you're Jackie Chan. I'm glad dumb fucks like you exist so the rest of us can have a laugh. I thought she was gonna turn out to be some sort of serial killer. That would had been really cool. Don't you think? Open mouth smile. Don't know if she has Facebook or some other social media app. But you could have checked there. Also if you keep your messages you could have looked at last year around that time and see when. Birthday stuff was talked about. Also you could have asked what she wanted to do for her birthday. 
and subtly asked, Do you know what day of the week your birthday falls on? Quote, Sunday to Saturday type thing. So if you're between two close dates it will confirm it for you. I hope you put it in your calendar now. Does she not have any form of social media account? Basically all of them list birthdays too haha. Probably for this reason. Lol. But. Hey. Not the worst way this could have gone. Also. Till you can pay for a background check on someone via Google. Damn. I was hoping she was some type of international fugitive. Oh well. Add her birthday to your phone, email calendar and you can set a reminder time frame so you get a reminder when that date approaches. My wife relies on me to remember dates and I find it easy to do so if I have those important dates on my phone calendar. My wife ran a background check on me. She found out I was just as boring back then as I am now. Something doesn't add up here. Normally to do a background check you need a name and a birthday. If not that, then a social security hash. An adult who gets mad at someone for forgetting their birthday one year into a relationship. Seriously. How many times have you even been given an opportunity to remember? Is not really an adult. They're a kid playing dress up. Does she not have Facebook? Checked her license. Dude, never go into a girlfriend's, wife's purse. R. Relationship advice. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Aircast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.